Yo, what is up everybody? It is me, Marty Zells, here back for a brand new video. Before this video starts, if you want to join the squad, make sure to click that subscribe button down below. And also, click that like button. It tells me you guys really like these types of videos. Also, only 1.3% of you guys are subscribed. What are you doing? Smash the subscribe button already. Anyways, let's hop right into this. Welcome back everybody to a brand new video. And, um... We got a, a very interesting type of video today. So, as you can see by the title, um, Infinite Earth is making Season 3. Uh, let's just hop right into this. Alrighty, so if I'm in the Discord server right now, you go to Announcements, you can see a interesting announcement about Season 3. So, let's just go ahead and read it. So, Prozellus, aka the owner, says, Season 3 confirmed. Yes, that's right, a new season is coming. And it'll be here faster than Season 2 took. Okay, um, Season 2 took, like, an, uh, a year. Like, <laughs> I, I hope it comes out a lot sooner than that. Um, alright, let's keep reading. What's gonna be in Season 3? Season 3 is mainly gonna include character updates, meaning we're gonna update all the characters add new characters, add new alter egos, add characters from the Arrowverse, and much more. So, like, I don't want to, like, disrespect the game or anything, but I thought that was going to be for Season 2. <laughs> um, but yeah, again, like, Infinite Earth always comes through with the awesome updates, so I have good faith in them. But I just, I was hoping that it was going to be chill on, like, Season 2 for a little bit, and then, like, it would be at least, like, a few months and we would get a lot more a bigger, bigger, smaller type of updates, if you know what I mean. And not just big updates like these. Because I, in my opinion, I don't really like these big updates. Because for me, it's hard to, like, give you guys content when stuff is taking, like, months to, um, to do. So, like, for example, if they have an update, like, let's just do Season 2, for example. The game didn't update for a year. I can't really give you guys content on this game if it doesn't really update that much. So, that's why I'm hoping that it's going to take a lot quicker to do. But I'm also hoping that they're going to do, like, smaller updates in between, at least. So that this way, like, um, we can also, like, get, play a little bit. I don't, how do I explain this? It'll be more fun as well. Okay. Anyway, let's move on. Also, they're going to add the Arrowverse, which is sick. I'm not too big of a fan of the Arrowverse, but I know a ton of you guys are, and that's just going to be cool to see. All right, moving on. We are also hoping to improve the game a lot more, considering we have been receiving an incredible amount of feedback from you guys. Um, and then we have, in Season 3, the game will no longer be a roleplay and a PvP. We will also add some sort of progression to the game, so that you can constantly play and unlock new things. That, that, that is what I'm most excited for, because it's not a simulator, but that's basically, like... In my opinion, that's kind of like what the simulator's type of about. Don't don't take this as a simulator. I'm taking this as a simu simulator. Basically, it's uh, just for example, Minecraft. It's endless. I think that's what they're going for. It's they're going for like if you don't want to roleplay, if you don't want to PvP, there's like something to grind for. Um, so yeah, I'm very excited for that because I can't. I I don't know. I I was always hoping this game would have something sort of like that. But anyway, all right, moving on. Um, we will not reveal what type of prog progression this will be, but one thing is for sure, all the free characters at the moment will still remain free forever. You will only be able to unlock new characters when completing the progression system we offer. So that's going to be, you guys are going to love that because this way you don't need to like buy like old free characters. You can just, it's basically they're just adding new characters pretty much and you have to do some stuff to unlock them. Kind of like the quest system that's already implemented. Um, so, uh, going towards the bottom, there will be much more to do. These are just the most exciting parts. New updates, question mark. There will be, there will be one update before we head over to the development of season three. It will include bug fixes, bug, blah, 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 blah. It will include bug fixes and a, f a few changes. We hope you are excited. Many sneak peeks will be posted under the development of season three. Now that is where I was kind of a little bit disappointed in because I was really hoping that they were gonna do like at least reskins while they do season three. Cause I don't know, I just I just I don't I don't want the game to die out like it did. Like we were getting like 50 players before, but I don't know. I'm just really hoping that again they will just post smaller updates while they develop it. Um, cause that'll just 
I think that'll just help the game a lot too, because it'll have much more characters um, for like us to use in the meantime. And also, those characters will also be in season three. So on top of all those other new characters that they're gonna add, we're also gonna have all those new characters that we just got while we were waiting. I think that's pretty awesome if they did do that, but who knows? All right, scrolling down, we want to see your ideas in season three. You can now submit your game ideas that you wish to see in. Uh, in season three um, So basically if you join the discord, uh, you have to verify otherwise there's no other way to um to do it But I'll put the link in the description. Hopefully I remember um, but if not just download discord um, uh, And make sure you read all the terms of service all the rules all that stuff um, And then you can always go to the procreations roblox group or you can go to um, Pro zealous's profile in roblox and then look for the discord um button thing all right anyway so he said we want to add as many uh new things and we know that you people have the most creative ideas so i'm just gonna say my stuff here because i i, I don't know I, I probably won't submit the thing but basically what i a few things i wanted to be added so basically you guys know savitar i was really hoping that like it was kind of like an iron man suit like for example like if you could get out of the suit and it like suit stays there and it's like a little bit opened up like detail you can like see the suit kind of opened up and then um so you can kind of have it like sentry mode where you can control the suit um and then uh you can like you know pvp with it and then um what's it called and then also if you're just using um savitar without the suit and you want to call the suit it'll run to you open up and then you'll like jump in backwards or something and i think that would be really really sick to see in the game um and yeah i think that would just be like so awesome and cool if they did that because that's i that's like the kind of thing that i was like really really hoping for in season two i mean there was n nothing about it so i didn't expect it but just something something like that because i feel like savitar is he is so cool and he just like i don't know he, he should have more more savitar type features like in the show but again this is all my opinion so if you guys get offended by this please do not get offended by this because it's just my opinion um and yeah so moving on also i hope that again they add these smaller updates while we wait for season three um because otherwise the game's gonna get pretty boring in my opinion and there will be nothing to do so yeah i'm really hoping they'll just add at least like reskins of the characters like reskin the sabotage reskin the monitor even though we just had one um reskin like trajectory or just something like that um because i think that that'll just boost the game like just in the right area so yeah i'm hoping they do that and then i'm trying to think what else that this game could add um i know you guys will have some brilliant ideas i will actually put the um google form in my description and i will also put it in the comments so this way you guys can submit it you don't need to be in the discord actually now that i think about it but it's always good to join the discord server because sometimes i'm a bit late to these announcements like this was posted yesterday i'm doing it the day after so again it's it's always good to join the discord as you can get all the announcements and all the info and they also do giveaways um but yeah i think that's pretty much it um let me know again your ideas in the comment section you can always submit it in the google form that i will post in the description but yeah thank you guys for watching and let's get right into this outro but anyways that is gonna do it for today's video i hope you all enjoyed smash like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the future see ya